Yep, so welcome back to the channel. Uh, it's been a while. I haven't uploaded anything since I think it was August. I'm sorry for that. Um, today I'm out again and I'm out shooting analog again. I haven't done that for a while, so it'll be. So I'm really enjoying the experience so far. Um, I brought the Hasselblad. Uh, it's a my 500C, which has been a little bit upgraded, so it's a CM basically. Uh, and today I took the the trip out here to Kuvon, and it's absolutely beautiful. Uh, first of all. I found myself a little startup composition, not the strongest in the world, but it's kind of striking. Um, my spot meter gives me um, it gives me a thirtieth of a second at f8, so I will go for that, and I will also try one at f11, and we'll see how we go with that. Nice to see you again. Yep, thought I would just talk you through this composition. And it's right behind me here. Uh, it's a beautiful pine trunk that is really meandering beautifully up here. Um, I have not quite decided on the angle yet, but I'm planning one straight on and one probably up the trunk. Uh, and we'll see where that leads us. It's looking really good, this one. Uh, in the camera today, I have a Berger Pancro 400, and I'm shooting it at 400. Uh, I need the speed, and I also want the grain. So I'm embracing the grain today, and I'll also do some stand development in rod and all with this one. wondering about this one but I'm gonna try um, I'm going to try to get the whites from this birch tree out um, in a contrast with all the darks around it um, I'm not a hundred percent sure about this composition but I will try it uh, I can see but I can see a big boulder up here so I will try that one afterwards found a composition that I really like uh, as you can see probably down here in my hustle blood um, I have a some grass here as a leading line up to a big rock I don't know if this is what you would call a boulder but it's a big rock at least uh, and then I want to try to follow the grass up to that uh, and I will probably make some kind of a crop on it, but I think this can look really really nice I will take three different photos uh, I will try three different shutter speeds on this one just to make sure I have the good one um, 
the burger pancro has been quite temperamental to me before when it comes to uh, when it comes to exposure but I'm that's what I have in the camera today I have a HP5 with me but I've kind of stuck to Berger on this one because I'm curious on how that will perform uh, I'm curious about this photo so I will try f11 and f16 at least and I'm and I will try two shot speeds on each of them so I will use four frames on this picture and I will show you which one turns out the best Well, I think that was the last picture in this video. I have one more on the roll, but it starts to rain. It started to rain, and rain and Hasselblads do not mix, not that well, at least. So I hope that you enjoy joining me for another short video, and I hope that you saw some photos that you found beautiful and nice I will for the first time in a long while write a little stub on my blog you can check that out in the description and it should be up shortly so I hope that you will pop by the blog as well thank you ever so much for joining me and I hope you're having a good day wherever you are. I can see here that the ferry to Kiel has just left Oslo, which is not that far away by sea. And I can see it's approaching Torbjörnsjär, which is really beautiful. So yeah, thank you for joining me and I'll see you again in a bit.